Good evening, Guillermo. Hello, good evening. So wait, we are gonna <clears throat> we're gonna wait for your classmates, okay? Okay. I am still at the work. Oh, wow. Well, you are still at work. So, yes. okay. But you are going to be here, but you are going to be as a listener, maybe. Okay, okay. So, I mean, the, it, when, when you are at home, let me know, I mean, to be pending, okay? Okay. Okay, okay, okay. Mm -hmm. Mr. Guzman, good evening. Good evening, teacher. How are you today? Yes, uh, fine, fine. Very good. So, so tired. Huh. Yeah, today is Wednesday. I mean, it's like the day when we start. I mean, no Monday. And at the end, and we are waiting just for Friday. <laughs> uh, me too. Yeah. I want, I want, oh, I want so Friday. Yes. Yeah. But I think so that, no, yeah. No, 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 it's Friday. And be, uh, in two Friday, maybe you are going to be, a day, you are going to have a day off huh? on September 15th. Uh, no. September. Yes, Friday. Ah, uh, yeah. So you're going to have a day off. Wait for me just for a moment. Hey, what about your classmates? Okay, they are coming. Wait, the camera. Hey, what about my camera? So, let me see. We are online. We are the champion. Okay, Sandra Alvarado, good evening. Good Ana Maria Rivas, welcome. Fatima Melendez, welcome. Where is it from? Germany is still at work. Yeah. Maybe I'm going to do this. Yeah, we have to do it. Okay, good evening, everybody. We are going to wait for some of your classmates, Miss. Oh, let me see if I think so that I didn't open. I think I'm gonna use this. 
This one I'm not gonna juice. This one yes, this one yes, no. No. This one yes. This one no. I can so that no. I wanna see history. Yeah. This is gonna be oh my god. Yeah. Okay, Mr. Beltran, welcome. Hi, hi teacher. It's a pleasure to to meet you here. It's not it's it's a pleasure for me also. I mean, nice to meet you. Yeah, thanks. <laughs> okay. <clears throat> well, we're gonna wait just for two minutes, okay. In order that your classmates can get in. I mean, what about what about what about no? Okay, wait just one minute and we are going to start even if you are just right now you are one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Send participants, okay. I don't know what happened. Are they afraid of the teacher? Good evening, everybody. Welcome to this new module. Karen Castillo is trying to come in. Monica Liliana is also. Roxana Ramirez. Yeah. <clears throat> okay. Eight, no, sorry, five past seven. Okay. Time to start. Good evening, everybody. Welcome again to a new module of Programa Nacional de Inglés para el Trabajo that is sponsored by sponsored by Insafor, given by Inglés Corporativo, okay? So for me, it's a pleasure to be here, to be your teacher. And I think, I think that we are going to be like a month. We are going to be learning I hope that you can learn it from me and I hope I can learn from you. So uh, this is module number four. And right now we have established a rule that it's that we don't help Spanish, okay? If you want to improve your English, you have to be forced to speak in English and you have to be forced to think in English, okay? So I'm gonna try to module my rhythm my fluency i'm not i'm not a native speaker i'm a learner i start here okay let me uh, before of everything let me uh, let me tell you something about the module and let me introduce myself okay so for we are going to start to share let me see i'm gonna start to share yeah this is i'm gonna share First of all, ah, maybe who am I? Yeah. Maybe who am I? Okay, this is. First of all, I'm gonna share. Okay, the course is English for Work program day one. The date is is Wednesday, August thirty first, twenty twenty three. Facilitador Carlos Najar. I'm stop sharing and let me see. Okay. Uh -huh. Right now I'm stop. Okay, this is me. Okay, this is me. I am Carlos Alexander Najarro Cruz. Uh, I have a master in education 
eh, have a master en tecnologías educativas y competencias digitales. I, am, I have a bachelor in English language o una, una licenciatura en idioma inglés. Este, my labor experience is I have been working for Regal International. Eh, I have been I have been teacher for about seven, no, 18 years. Mm -hmm. uh, I'm working as a tutor of English language uh, since to, since 2016, sorry. That's me. I mean, uh, no, not important, but I mean, I have to be like, I'm gonna stop chatting. And we're going to start share again. Let me see. We're gonna we have to move. And I'm gonna share. Okay. Hablo español por un momento. No soy nativo del inglés, pero creo que es la meta que llevamos. Así es que me pasaré un poco al idioma español para explicar algunas cosas acá. Bueno, tareas y evaluaciones. Eh, bueno, son errores de, de dedo, solo eso. Pero este, es necesario obtener el 80% en promedio de tareas y evaluaciones para poder completar el curso satisfactoriamente. Las tareas se encuentran en la plataforma justo después de cada clase. Todas las tareas de los temas ya cubiertos tienen que estar completas antes de cada martes a la medianoche y ya en las últimas dos sesiones antes de cada miércoles. Eh, ya que este registro es enviado a Insaport semanalmente. La fecha límite para terminar el examen medio es el martes 12 de septiembre, antes de la medianoche. La fecha límite para terminar el examen final es el miércoles 27 de septiembre, antes de la medianoche. El manual puede ser descargado en la plataforma y en este caso ya está en el grupo de WhatsApp. Me imagino que algunos se agregaron después, así es que lo vamos a reenviar. El manual puede ser descargado y no se utiliza material de terceros en las sesiones. Material es creado por nosotros. Eh, ¿Qué más hay? Requerimientos. Nombre completo, por favor, al conectarse a la plataforma. Si hay algún oyente, pues agrega oyente. Ahí, luego de su nombre, la cámara encendida durante toda la sesión. Esto no es algo que he inventado. Es una regla de, es una regla de Insafor. O sea, Insafor quiere saber que usted está pendiente, no quizás que ya estamos ahí, qué sé yo, cansados un poco y pues qué sé yo, eh, con la almohada o qué sé yo. Yo sé que es difícil, pero pasa, ¿no? A veces ya esta es una hora un poco difícil, pero creo que hemos adquirido un compromiso y beneficioso para ustedes el, el poder aprender el idioma inglés. Luego, minimizar el sonido ambiente lo más posible y una participación activa, por favor. Asistencia al 100% de las clases, cumplir con los 120 minutos de clase, generar asistencia efectiva por cada sesión. La asistencia se toma en dos ocasiones, mínimo 7.20 y 8.40. Se tomará como válida al escuchar al participante decir presente y tener cámara encendida. Sesiones de uno a uno disponibles cada día, cada participante es asignado 10 minutos al finalizar cada clase para aclarar dudas con su facilitador. Permisos no hay disponibles de mi parte ni de Insafor, así es que tampoco es una regla que yo haya creado. Así es que muchas veces me preguntan, mire, teacher, ¿no podré estar eh, en tal sesión? Yo pues no digo nada. Y usted podrá decir que soy mal educado porque no me contestó, pero así son las reglas. Botón silencio, cámara encendida chat, breakout rooms, si usted necesita alguna ayuda, el botón de ayuda, el respeto ante todo, por favor, así es que eso, eh, y ahí las tareas de evaluaciones, semana 1, sección 1, del 30 de agosto al 5 de septiembre, semana 2, del, del 6 al 12, semana 3, del 13 al 20, y semana 4, del 21 al 27, que es el examen final. No sé si hay alguna pregunta acá. Todavía pueden hablar en español. Si no, de ahí, pues, trate de hablar inglés y no me vea mal, profesor, mire, sino que, pues, ya ando en algo rodada en, esta, en este rubro y, pues, 
es cierto, a veces nosotros como no vemos la necesidad de hablar inglés, no nos forzamos, así es que trataré en un 99% de hablar inglés. Trate, y si usted dice, mire, trate de escribirme, trate de usar, aunque sea ponga mute y use el traductor, y luego si quiere me lo dice en inglés, trate de pronunciar de la mejor manera para que nos entendamos y vaya forzándose a hablar inglés. Este... No sé, alguna, alguna pregunta, tenemos dos minutos todavía, dejo de compartir, dos minutos para el español, dejo de compartir, ok, alguna pregunta en español todavía, because after we are going to go for English, and we are going to try to do the, the class uh, full English, I'm going to try, because maybe uh, I can forget it, maybe I can go um, to Spanish, but... Uh, I will try to do it just in English. Uh, as I told you, como les dije, traten, tratemos de esforzarnos y forzarnos a pensar, a comer, a dormir, a, a hacer todo en inglés, al menos estas dos horas. Porque si no, pues no desaprovechemos la oportunidad. Mm. Así es que eso sería. Tienen todavía un minuto para alguna pregunta. No sé. Para mí es un placer ser su maestro. Espero que nos vaya bien. Sé que como en cada curso extra extrañarán a su maestro anterior, pero así son las cosas. Así es que espero que al final del curso, como digo, hayan aprendido de mí y yo pueda haber aprendido de ustedes. ¿Questions? Si algo no entendemos en inglés, Mr. Puede, por lo menos en el chat, le doy permiso de que use ahí en el chat, le voy a dar permiso de que use el español. Ah, pero eh, oralmente trate de, de forzarse a hablar inglés. No nos vamos a entender quizás, pero en la medida que lo intente, lo va a lograr. La práctica hace al maestro. Así es que igual conocen ya las reglas. Eh, yo sé que algunas veces no se puede, pero en la medida de lo posible, trate de tener la cámara encendida. Eh, porque pues, constantemente estamos siendo supervisados y quizás a veces no nos damos cuenta, pero puede pasar la supervisión y a veces decir qué sucede con estos participantes. Ok, 15 past 7. It means that I have to go for English. Ok, uh, good evening everybody. We are going to go to the development of the class. Paso al español, por favor, trate de hablar, pierda el miedo, no es que mire como yo no sé, he estado aquí, please, speak in English, ok, aunque sea yes, no, o una palabra que dé un comentario, vale la pena, pero esfuércese y, y haga el esfuerzo, o sea, y así como cuando por obligación, we have to speak in English, do it, ok, after that, let me see what do we have to start. Let me see. Uh -huh. Let me see. That. Okay, we have here. We have a question. At least a word I want to I wanna hear. Okay, at least a word. And the question is, what do you like to buy when you go shopping? Uh-huh. What do you like to buy when you go shopping? Robert Beltran, a word, I mean. Okay. Uh, you shall go for ice cream with my son. Or? Even ice cream. Uh, oh, yeah. Ice cream. Uh, you ice shall cream. Go... Ah, ice cream. I... Ah, good. Okay. Hey, good. How, how, well, how well do you hear me, Tisha? No, 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 no. Right now, very well. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, as I, was, as I was telling you, uh, you shall go. Go for ice, ice cream, cream with my son, and sometimes we go for pupusas to Excellent. get pupusas. Good. And what more could I say? Let me think over. Um, and sometimes we go for a pizza. Excellent. Pollito uh, campero. Uh, I don't know if he, I can say that. Word in English, pollo campero. Uh, no, that is word? no, that is not a word for that one. Ice cream, okay. pizza. 
Okay, nice. the famous Pollo Campero. Pollo Campero. Excellent, <laughs> Pollo Campero. Good. Thank you, Mr. Tran. Okay. Miss Alvarado, can you show me a product that you, you would like to go? Would you, you, you shopping, Sandra Alvarado? Oh, maybe she's not there. Okay. Um, go eat pizza or is a cream? Ice cream. Ah, okay. Ice what cream. We have here pizza and ice cream. Thank you, Sandra. Mr. Walter Reyes. I buy. Subway. What? I, I buy Subway one to shopping. So, Subway? Yes. Ah, okay, good. Subway. Very good. Thank you. Margot. Margot Benitez Diaz. Ruth Margot. Um, hi. I like to go shopping, especially um, a chicken compare. Chicken compare, chicken pollo compare, good. They're famous. <laughs> eh. And? Pan dulce, no sé cómo se Excellent. I mean, the, the famous they are say sweet. Entonces, en coffee. Sweet bread. Uh, sweet bread. Coffee. coffee. Oh my God. <laughs> Good, excellent. You are going to, you could be my favorite student, okay? <laughs> Baby Romero. Hello, teacher. Hi, mister. Um, the usual in full, um, I'm pupusa. I like pupusa. Excellent. Um, um, uh, my song, I guess, is Hog Dog. Hog Dog. In mm. Spanish, yeah, the famous Perros Calientes. Okay, good. Thank you, Roxana Ramirez. Hi, teacher. Hi, Roxana. Uh, Subways, too. Subways. Oh, excellent. The famous yeah. Subways. Thank you. Good. Monica, Liliana. Oh. Oh. Ana Consuelo. Hi, teacher. Hi. I like to go shopping Pupusa. Pupusas, excellent. Yes. Mm -hmm. Thank you. Ana Maria Rivas. Hello. Hi. I like um, a meat, a grill. Meat? Yes, meat. Ah, okay, meat. Beef meat? Chicken meat, duck meat, duck, not duck, duck. <laughs> okay. No, I, I didn't say duck. I say duck. That is different. Good. Thank you, meat. Fatima. Oh, teacher. Hi. Just food. Food. Mm. Okay. Just food, all kind of food. Karen Castillo. Hello. Hi. I like a uh, Kate's um, Pollo Campero. Kate's? Sí. Yes. Oh. <laughs> and and pollito, <laughs> pollito Campero, that's okay. Mr. Ruano? Good evening, teacher. Good evening. Uh, well, uh, in my case, I trying to like to buy uh, 
Uh, and food and pizza or a coffee? Ah, excellent, coffee. We have there. This art may be the most common product. Thank you, mister. Hey, did I forget somebody? No. No. Okay, I'm stop sharing. So right now, here we go for the attendance list, okay? Please remember that you have to listen your name and you have to say present, okay? Uh, I mean, okay, here we go. Uh, Alexa Lucia Mendez Perez. Anael C. Santos Gómez. Diana Beatriz Rudas Hueso. Diana Jocelyn Borja de Núñez. Wait, let me see. Sorry. I think so that I'm committing a mistake here. I want to see. Yeah, let me see. Sorry, sorry, sorry. Uh -huh. I think so that this is... Oh, yeah. Sorry, sorry, sorry. I was coming in a mistake. So sorry. Okay, right now, I am on the right attendance list. That's why. Ana Consuelo Amaya. Okay, Ana Maria Rivas Duran. Present teacher. Thank you. Eh, Brenda Angelica Diaz. Present teacher. Good. Karen Beatriz Castillo. Present teacher. David Armando Romero. Present teacher. Diego Rodolfo Ruano. Present. Eh, Fátima Laura Mejía Meléndez. Present teacher. Gabriela Margarita Vázquez. Present teacher. Eh, Guillermo Josué Osorio. Present teacher. José Roberto Ramírez. Present. Karen Patricia Ramírez. Catherine Guadalupe. I think so. Present. Okay, thank you. Monica Liliana Ocotán. Present. Roberto Antonio Guzmán. Present. Roxana Elizabeth Ramírez. Present. Ruth Margot Benítez. Present. Sandra Yamilet Alvarado. Teacher. Present. Okay. Present. Walter Manuel Reyes. Present teacher. Okay, thank you. I mean, did I mention somebody? No, did I, didn't I mention somebody? No mencioné a alguien. A todos, everybody's, everybody's done? Okay. So, continue. Okay. Oh my God, so we have to do this with the right document. Okay, uh, I'm gonna show you features of products. I will show you some products, some characteristics, I mean, some vocabulary. Maybe in this case, we're going to use maybe Spanish and English. Let me see, because it's according to the one that I have. Uh, what about, where is it? Oh, I didn't... I know that's it. Ah, okay. So, this book right now is mine, okay? So, 
Now, let's see. Here we go. Let me see. This is the way that, that we go to buy. Look at here. We have ham, pork chops, steak, chicken, pea, lettuce, carrot, spinach, tomato, green bean, cauliflower, garlic, onion, Brussels sprout, potato. If you want to write down to, to, to buy uh, seafood or fruit, grapes, raspberries, strawberries, sweet, I mean, banana, peach, ripe, apricot, melon, lemon, sharp, cherry, plum, apple, pear. Uh, what is sold? Look at here. Here we have, if you are asking, hey, teacher, what is the meaning of? This is fish, sold, okay? And this is the fruit, okay? We have here the Spanish, okay? Like raspberry, like ripe i think so that is ripe it's uh and we have sharp melon apricot plum sorry and also we have here some desserts okay who says cake i like to buy cakes who says that donuts who likes donuts pastry biscuit uh -huh. Recipe that is a recipe to cook in this case. And you have also yogurt, margarine, cream, milk, honey, eggs, jam, oil, salt, pepper, spices, flour, flour, I mean, flour, sorry, flour, yeah. Frozen food, herbs. I don't know. Do you have any question? Describe different, I mean, huh? Could you say something about which word is new for you? This is my the most common, okay. I think so that oh also we don't know we just uh-huh. What about do you like lamp? Do you know what is lamp? Hello. Hi, hi teacher. I'm here. Do you like lamp? Lamp. <laughs> I don't know what does it mean, lamp teacher. Why what, what what does it mean? Ah look at here. Lake lamp. of lamp. It's yeah, it's there. here. Yeah, I see, I see. Now, lack of lamb. Tisha, yeah. uh, do you mind to share this picture in our WhatsApp group, please? Uh, maybe no, not right now, because this is from my, uh, from my, but I can, okay? Oh, I please. will. Let okay, me see. thank you, Tisha. I, I, I don't, because... I, I, I won't do it right now, but maybe I will do after, okay? Believe it. I yeah, will. okay. Thanks, because oh. we can we can take notes about yeah, this we, new we can, vocabulary. We, we can have there are new, vocabulary. Yeah, I know. There are new words here that I, I, I don't even know right now, you know. Ah, that's why. It's okay, because you're learning. Uh-huh, guys. Huh? Mm hmm A hundred, I mean, also noodles, pasta. Ice cream, who likes ice cream, chocolate. Mm. There are a lot of vocabulary, no? So, can we describe the, the, the leg of lambs by example? Or the cream, just the cream? Chicken on the, on the steak, 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 steak. You say steak. Steak is another, another thing. Steak. Uh huh. Any new word that you like, or anything that you see here that you like? Also, can you share on the on the on the on the on the chat? Can you share us? I mean, what is Bill? You see, Bill Ternera. I mean, you can share on the chat. I like. Uh, I like uh, the. I like. Sorry. I like. Salmon. I like salmon. Sorry, but my A. I, sorry. I like salmon. I don't know. Mm -hmm. 
Hello, hello. Are you are you still there or am I alone? So I'm gonna stop chatting. Okay, I'm gonna after I'm gonna share the, the picture of I'm gonna try to. Okay, you have seen there uh, the products, the new products that you got to buy. They are some of the they are common, like you show us, like you tell us when you were, I uh, mean, when you were sharing like uh, maybe ice cream, like pizza, like coffee, maybe like meat, like cakes. Okay, but they are another non-common or uncommon product that you don't buy. Okay. Let's gonna see the manual right now. Let me see. Ta, ta, ta. I'm here. So I'm here. Lemon section two allows participant to help you match in match the correct options. Okay, that's gonna practice with that. Okay, who wants to be Aaron and who wants to be Sam? Volunteers? I, I would like to be Aaron. Aaron, okay, and Roberto Guzman, you will be? Sam. Okay. Okay. I'm going to start. Okay. The new material just arrived in the morning. Tell Max that he has to store everything. Uh-huh. He's there. Hello? Guzman. Are you there, bro? I don't know what happened with Mr. Guzman. Mm, maybe his microphone, it doesn't yeah, work. Yeah, maybe he's having problems with... Hello? Oh, okay, it's there. Do you Switch want there. me to start again or what? Uh, me. Okay. The new material just arrived in the morning. Tell Max that he has to store everything. I cannot hear you, bro. Me too. No. Maybe he's having a problem with the microphone. Yeah. Okay, I'm gonna continue. Where does he have to store the boxes? He and Ivan or Ivan? I mean, uh, we don't know. I mean, in English could be Ivan. In Spanish okay. could be Ivan. Okay. okay. He and Ivan, we can say. Okay. He and Ivan have to store them in the warehouse. Uh, okay, but there are many boxes. Can they use the lift? Um, I am busy right now, please. Okay, they, they have to use the lift, but ask and tell the secretary first. Oh, she's going to say they can use they can use it. Then I'm going to tell Max and Ivan what they have to do. Okay. So it means this is the conversation about the features. I don't know what that's Okay, uh, let's gonna say, I mean, let's gonna see, and we are gonna see that the, the exercise number three, that is here. And we have to read the conversation again and, and circle the correct answer. Let's gonna do together, okay? Let's gonna read again. And we are going to, it says, Max and Ivan have to, or has to start the boxes. Oh. That's a grammar. Okay, this is number four. Let me see something. Just, I want to see something. Oh. 
Yeah, yeah, I'm looking for yeah, I'll that. Okay, so the new material just arrived in the morning. Thomas, the the he has <coughs> to start it to start everything. Max and Ivan have or has to start the boxes. Uh huh. Which will be have to have to start boxes. Have to or has to has to. So A or B, I mean. Is he gonna say that this is A and this is B? Oh well, write down on this, write down on the chat. Say have to or has to. Okay. Say number one, have to or has to. Number one is number one is is no, but we are gonna say like here, like 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 that, okay. Have two, we can say number one, have two. Or you say number one has two. Yes, has two is third person. No. Max and Ivan had to store boxes. Uh-huh. I are speaking about day. Yeah. Okay, I forget, I forget, I forgot it. I don't worry. Yeah, That's yes, why yeah. it means that is uh that's the right answer. Second one, Aaron. Aaron doesn't have or doesn't have two or doesn't has two. Huh? Have two. Have two. Have two. Oh my god. Have to. Oh, I don't know what happened to me. Have to. Yeah, because you have doesn't, and when you have doesn't, you don't have to write down the third person of the verb. It means that it's our own doesn't have to. Third one. Sam doesn't have to or doesn't has to. Sam doesn't have to. Exactly. Thank you, mister. And the last one. The secretary have to or has to. Have to. Have to. No. It has have. to. Has to. Yeah, it has to because it's third person. Okay. She has to say that they can use the lift. Okay. Mm -hmm. That's it. Okay. Question here. Question here, guys? No. Mm, I got a question. Tell me. What? What does she mean when he said he cannot use the lift? Where? Conversation. Uh, I mean, let me see. Can they use the mm. lift? That's it? Yeah, the lift, but there there are many boxes. Can they use the lift? What ah, does it mean lift? Lift. Case, lift is lift. a machine. That's a machine. Yeah, that, that is a machine that you have to drive and it has like a it has like a fork. Okay. Oh, okay. okay. Like a fork, and you have to start. Oh, okay. Uh-huh. Okay. Thank you. Okay, you're welcome. Okay, so right now we're going to do, 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 we're going to go to task preparation project. Let me know if they will display the document he has used since the beginning. He's explained different. Okay, let me see. I'm stop sharing and
wait. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that's it. Okay, I will share my document. Let me see. Let me see if I can use it. Okay, right now I'm gonna explain to you. Countable and uncountable noun or count in non-count nouns. What are countable nouns? Countable nouns or count nouns are words that we can easily put a number next to. They have a singular and plural forms and can be used with the numbers one, two, etc., etc. Uncountable, uncountable nouns, they also noun as non-count nouns are nouns that cannot be counted. They do not have a plural form and they cannot be used with numbers. Okay, examples of our countable and uncountable nouns, guys. Mm -hmm. um, okay, and the, the first one, countable noun might be uh, bottles of water. Uh, uh, yeah, but when you say bottle, it's a, when you say just water, Okay, water is an uncountable noun. Yeah, yeah, that's why. Uh -huh. Yeah, I said you can say a book, two books. Exactly, maybe. that's it, Mr. Beltran. Uh huh. Any okay, guys? Any other example? Thank you, Mr. Beltran. You are very smart. You can say. Um, I was studying this topic before, teacher. Oh, really? Yeah. Before this in another academy or before this that we have to start to start the English class today? Um in another academy. Ah but still by in the same level, you know. Ah okay, that's okay. Yeah, okay. It's, it's a, this is okay. Uh-huh. Another uncountable or uncountable uncount or countable now, guys. Hello, hello. Are you there? Where? Are you now, guys? Please answer. I need you now. The countable nouns a pen or a cell bed. phone. Uh huh. Uh huh. Uh, a book. A book. Yeah, I yeah. think so. If it's that's my opinion that the countable nouns are easier. But what about yeah. uncountable nouns? Uh huh. Example are uncountable nouns or non count nouns, guys. The stars, the stars maybe, rice, sugar, yes. the salt. Oh, honey, honey, yeah, sugar. What about sugar? What about sand? You know the sand. Ah, yeah, I have some examples. Food, sand. Ah, thank you, Mr. Bertrand. Sugar, to sugar, you say salt. What about salt? Salt, uh huh. Mm -hmm. Okay, quiet, quiet. Ah, another example overall liquids. Yeah, our liquids. Yes, Mr. Beltran. I'm gonna close, I'm gonna close. I have some example on our, our uncountable now. Let's gonna see one by one. Oh no, one by one now. That's it. Listening to music will make you feel relaxed. What is the uncountable noun? Uh-huh. Listening teacher, relax teacher. No. <laughs> uh huh. Are you boring, guys? Are you? I mean, 
I'm, I'm, I'm feeling sad. What? What is the uncountable noun here? Mm -hmm. Music. Music is an uncountable noun. What about the second one? We are relaxing our body beside the beach. Re uh huh. The sun. What? The sun. No, but in this case, not there is no zen. I mean, I know that it's zen in the beach, but it's not zen. Is relaxing. Relax is an uncomfortable noun. I mean, uh, we cannot say one relax to relax to relax. Say relaxing. Mm -hmm. Second, the third one, and a, and a spaceship sent by NASA has lost its orbit into space. The what is the noun? You can take notes of the nouns, uh huh? Air, even, yeah. Thank you, Mr. Bertrand. Uh huh. What is the noun? Guys, please answer. I need to. I need to hear you. Uncountable noun. Yeah, here in this. Yeah, sentence. where you. When someone wants to, want to make a question. No, I mean just you just you have to say the the the, the uncountable now in the third sentence, Mister. Third sentence. The spaceship sent uh -huh. by NASA has lost its orbit to space. So uh -huh. The stars, the stars. Do but there are no stars in the sentence. Money also, yeah, Roberto Guzman. Money. What is the uncountable noun? Hello, hello. The ice cream teacher. Huh? The ice cream. Which one? The ice cream. The ice cream. I don't know. Yeah, could be, but in this case, yeah, but remember. Uh, for example, it can be said, yeah, but remember in this case, it's okay. But in this case, in this sentence, let me see, I'm gonna paint uh, here. I'm gonna use, in this sentence, okay? In this sentence. Which is the uncountable noun in this sentence? Mm. It's a spaceship, it lost maybe, orbit, mm, space. NASA, which is that's what is it, what is its names uh, they are the star mm, mm -hmm. uh, they are not the star uh, uh, I don't know I don't know the, 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 I don't know if if the uh, my bad man. <laughs> space is the space is the satellites 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 okay yeah. satellites but in this case is a space a space spaceship it's no a space a spaceship now because a spaceship you can count a space is the uncountable noun the number four okay number four is easy space space huh Espacio, space. No, space, aha, uh -huh, espacio. That is uncountable noun. The yeah, space is infinite. I didn't get it, the, the sentence number three. Ah, uh -huh. uh, that's right. But right now, <laughs> what about number four? Ah, uh, countable sugar. Yeah, sugar too. <laughs> Oh, honey, honey. That's it. Number five. 
Let me see. It's gonna see number five. Uh huh. He has late. He was late because he the belt of the belt. The time. No, number five. Weather. Weather. Yeah, weather. Okay, let's gonna read number six. Work is worship until we do it. Number six. Work. Weather. And our water. Yeah. Uh huh. Work. Ya descubrí. You discovered the secret. Number seven. I discovered the secret right now. <laughs> number hmm. seven. Pasta. Pasta. Ha, you discovered it. I discovered it. In the first one, you didn't get it. But right now, you I got it. it. <laughs> Girls and women love shopping. That's true. Is it true or not? <laughs> Girls and women love shopping. Uncountable. <laughs> so comfortable, <laughs> but that is true or, or false? <laughs> we don't know yet. And uh, number number nine, he needs complete satisfaction after the message. Satisfaction. Uncountable. It's uncountable. Yeah, all of these are uncountable. Satisfaction is uncountable. Okay. And the last one. Uh huh. What is the uncountable noun? Salt. Salt. Uncountable. Yeah, salt. salt. The taste of salt is more in this soup. Okay, these are example are uncountable noun. You see all of these that you you see bolded. Uh -huh. They are uncountable now. We can say like a list. Music, relaxing, space, sugar, weather, work, pasta, shopping, satisfaction, and salt. Though all these are uncountable nouns, okay? Diego, tell me, Mr. Diego Ruano. Sure, I have a doubt with Tell the me. no, with the no pasta because yeah. it's a food. And uh, in this case, um, I must do. Uh, I don't know what do you say a, a specifico uh, uh, with the food or, or any any food is uh, uncountable now. No, it depends. I mean, pasta. I will almost. I mean, all the foods that I mean, like, 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 like maybe, uh, maybe beans are uncountable. Maybe some fruits they are like, uh, uh, they they are countable, like oranges, bananas, maybe watermelon, and something like that. But almost all food, but not all food is uncountable like rice beans sugar maybe um i mean we have to to do like a like a survey maybe we can go oh well uh like a survey which food is an uh isn't countable it isn't uncountable but maybe the mass of food is uncountable not but not all the food is uncountable I don't know if you get it, Mr. Ruano. Yes, yes, I get okay. it. Okay. So did I clear? Yeah. We did it. We did it. We did it. We did it. So sorry, but I'm in that way, guys. <laughs> please don't please don't leave me, okay? Because I'm like that. Don't abandon me. And also you are gonna know the the, the, the sound that I have to when you have to go. Countable nouns, countable nouns. Uh-huh, countable nouns. The first sentence. The first sentence. Uh-huh. Countable is... Which one? Eggs. Excellent. Eggs. Second one. Countable... Mm -hmm. 
Boop. Which one? They are in look like shred. <laughs> Ooh. Which are I mean, cupboard. Yeah, but they, what is the oh, well, but the, in this case, which which is the countable noun or the the most I mean we can say like the most common countable noun. And books. The yeah. Number two. Book. Number three. Apple. Apple, yeah, remember this this saying. This is a saying, guys. You know what is a saying in English? You know what is a saying in English? You know what is a saying? Saying is like a take notes. If I say, it's not I say. Mm, we can say that is like a wisdom, like a, I mean, I mean, like, what am I? I don't know. Let me explain. Let me tell you in this way, maybe. Oh, so. In Spanish, saying is a, that one. You can What's the saying? Huh? Okay, saying. Yeah, that's it. So that's why you said an apple a day keep the doctor away. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. That's it. An apple a day keep the doctor away. That is a saying. Like a coach potato. Mm -hmm. Wanna continue here. Okay. For one. Uh-huh. Mm -hmm. Which is the countable now in this sentence? Cyber cafe. Yes, who did? Very good. Cyber cafe. Because also you can discover it this time because you have a, 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 a number before the noun, okay? You have a good number. Okay, number five. Hey, that's okay. Uh huh. Ice cream. Every kid likes to eat ice cream. Guys, there are sometimes maybe, well, after I will tell you. Okay, no, hi. Ice cream. In Un conto? Uh, that, uh, that would be the question I I would like to know. That's why I want to say what I mean. Uh-huh. Ice cream. It's a noun. Uh-huh. But the point is, uh, if I don't remember very well, I think so that they are like, uh, let me see. Also, if no, in this case, I'm I'm not doing good. Ah, that's it, the question. No, so that's why it's a mistake. That is not an ice cream. I mean, but uh, again, let me see. So, ah, that's what I I want to see. Let me see. Uh huh. Yeah, but I want to see. Uh huh. I mean, <laughs> that's why. Okay, ice cream could be both. Let, didn't you? Didn't you hear me? Ice cream yeah. could be both. Could be countable. Are uncountable, okay? Uh, yeah, I mean, we can say that it's countable, and that's uncountable as a dessert. 
that as a portion is a countable. Yeah, but not all of this, but could be in this case, it says that ice cream could be countable and uncountable. In this case, it's countable. Okay. The number five. Yeah. Mm. Okay, number six. Number six. Uh-huh. Number six. Parmint? Yes, parmints. Good. Parmint. Parmints. Number seven. What? Which one? Wheel. Uh -huh. Hello. Hello. Wallet. Wallet. Yeah, that's a wallet. Uh huh. And here one, which is. No, no, no. Oh, pizza. Uno ocho, le toca la mitad de la pastilla. La mitad de la pastilla. De la mitad de la pastilla. Ajá. Uh -huh. okay. Una que son blanquitas. Que solo son como ocho. La mitad. Carba macepina. Carba macepina mm, se llama. Ok. Ajá. Uh -huh. I order pizza. Pizza is uh, countable now. Yeah. Yeah. Pizza is the countable now. Yeah. Uh huh. Uh. Number nine. Mm. Which one? Teeth. 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 Oh, number ten. But it says they go to a movie every Sunday. Movie. Movie. Excellent. Those are countable and are countable now. Okay. So let me see. Okay. I imagine. Okay, let me oh I'm gonna stop chatting and let me see something. That's it. Let me see. Why do we have to stop? Oh wah, wah, wah. yes, but I did. How do we know about this? I mean, I mean, we remember. We have to know that. I mean, we have to know the different, the differences between countable and uncountable now to create some questions. Okay, I'm gonna show you right now. And when you need to purchase in a store, you need to how to use countable and uncountable nouns. Okay. Right. This is how much is used for uncountable nouns, okay? And how many is used for countables? You got it? 
Let me see if I can write something here. Uncountable. Oh. And countable. Okay, look at it here. Uncountable and countable. For uncountable, we use how much. Okay. So, Mr. Roberto Beltran, can you read the first question, please? Okay, how much does the refrigerator weigh? Exactly. Uh, I don't know who wants to read the second one. Somebody can raise their hand, don't stumble. You should be picking up. So uh, oh, like... I, I should okay. So we have to uh, we have to do it. I mean with authority, not with democracy. Okay, Monica Liliana, please. <laughs> Sorry, I will use my authority as a teacher. Could you read the second one, Monica Liliana? Yes, no. Please. Uh-huh. Can you read the second one? This one. How much does it cost? Exactly. How much does it cost? That's it. The, 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 the common question. The common question when you want to buy something that is, how much does it cost? I mean, how much does it cost that you can translate like, sorry, ah, uh, sorry by, by my question marks. That's the translation, okay? How much does it cost, okay? Margot Benitez, can you read the sec the third one? Yes, Margot. Hey. Yes, teacher. How? Oh. How much is the? In this case, it's warranty. <laughs> warranty. How much is the warranty? Yeah, but I mean, but I will correct if I'm. Yeah, warranty. How much is the warranty? Yeah, that's it. Okay, Walter Reyes, can you read the other one? How much does it storage? How much does it storage? Excellent. Thank you. Fatima, can you help us with this one? How many features does it have? How many features does it have? Yeah, does it have? Good. How many features does it have? Excellent. Consuelo Maya. How many colors is this in? How many colors is this in? Yeah. Roxana. How many functions? Functions. Functions. Yeah. Does it have? Does it have? How many functions does it have? Like when you buy, okay, like when you buy something, like a car maybe. David Romero, can you help us? How many products do you want? Excellent. How many products do you want? Very, very good. Huh? Uh, okay. I don't know if you have any question, guys, here. Can you give me an example, please? Can you start to write down an example? Here. Can you tell me an example, okay? Orally, let's gonna do it orally because I wanna listen. I wanna I, I wanna listen 
to your voice. I want to listen to your, I mean, your beauty voice because I don't have the picture to, to listen to your voice, okay? Mr. Beltran, I mean, I know, but even if you want to do a question, can you can you ask me, I mean, how, how many or how much, I mean? Okay. Mm -hmm. mm. We saw this topic in the first module, teacher. Yeah, I so remember. I don't, I, mean, know. Uh -huh. I don't know why my partners don't want to, to improve. They, they don't want to participate. They don't want to participate. They are shy, um, but they don't know the teacher. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe by using the how much how yeah, and then many. Um, um, uncountable maybe how much yeah, uncountable or uh, uncountable let amounts. me let me think we have to say how much the uh, things is missing a little bit of information about uncountable now because if you want to make uh, I'm sorry I for, I forget we don't we. We don't see already that how to make a question, but it may be how many bottles of water. Yeah, oh, let me show you again. The how much is for yes. uncountable? Is like, how much is for uncountable? If, for if uh, yeah, okay. And how if many is for countable? How much water do you drink? Exactly. That's okay. That's How much question. water That's do you drink? Question. Good. How much water do I drink? Maybe like four glasses per day. Yeah. Thank you. Monica Liliana. Question, Monica Liliana. Okay. Uh -huh. A question? How much? How many? No. <laughs> no, do one. I mean, do it because I mean to practice, Monica, please. <laughs> no. Okay. You are shy. Fatima? How many students in the uh -huh. class? How many students? I mean, do you have in your class? Yeah, eighteen. I think so. I think so. They are eighteen. Thank you, Fatima. Margot. Mm -hmm. Question mm -hmm. using how many, how much? No, I think how much is plural and how many singular? I mean, uh, most that if they are plural or singular, uh, how much is used with non count nouns and and how many is used with count of oh, count noun? Sorry. Oh, okay. Thank you. Uh -huh. Okay. Walter, a question? Sure. Huh? Uh, how much is in for travel? Uh, how many for travel? Uh, example, the infant cover. How much does unit of the student in the box? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Uh, example, the cover. Okay. How many? Mm -hmm. The yeah. Person, the person. How many persons? Uh, what? Uh, how much? How much people? Is is uh, is that is the church? Uh, is in the church. Uh -huh. That's it. Yes. Okay. I got it. 
Sandra. Uh, how many fruits do you want? Oh, thank you. Mm -hmm. uh, Roxana. Hi, teacher. Hi, Roxana. Uh, how many books do you have? Mm -hmm. How many boxes or what? Boxes. Box. Yeah. Do you have mm -hmm. how how much water is? Uh -huh. How much water do you drink? Maybe. Or how much water is in the sea? It's in the lake. In the lake, sorry. <laughs> okay. Yeah. Thank you. Thank you. Consuelo. David Romero. Um, call giving an other example the the use the how many e how most in countable. Countable, and if I can give you more examples, other examples. Um. How much soda do you drink, maybe? How much money do you have? Do you have money? Countable. And the, the countable that they use is how, how many? Yeah, that's why I say, how much money do you have? Because how much and is some countable? An um, example... Um, how many beers in the sky? <laughs> How many? Beers in in the sky. I mean, could you spell beers? I mean, I don't know. I don't got it. Ah, beers. Beers, huh? B -I, I B I B I R D S. That's it? Yeah. Ah, okay. How many? Yeah, that's it. How many birds in the sky? In the sky, sorry. In the sky. Oh, okay. How many? How much trees in the forest? Maybe or how many trees? Sorry, how many? How many trees in the forest? It's okay. Okay, that's okay. I think so that you got it. Hi, T-shirt. Hi. Before make a question using this uh, countable and uncountable uh, after the noun we have to say there is are there or is there mm, not necessary it doesn't matter it doesn't matter it depends if you if you are pointing maybe a place or if you are describing a place. Oh, okay, that's, yeah. that's right. It's not necessary. Right. Yeah. It's not necessary. You, you have to say, is there or there something like that? Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Catherine Guadalupe. Catherine. I like the name. Catherine. Hello. Hello, Catherine. Um, how many colors do you like? Excellent. Oh, how many? How much? How much do you have now? How much? What do you have now? Yeah, that's okay. How much? But I mean, how much? What? You need a noun there. Mm. How much sugar, as my example? <laughs> or how much hair, as my example? How much hair do you have? Don't ask about my hair. <laughs> 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 yeah, but it could be a question, okay? How much? <laughs> hair do you have I mean, we're going to start to, to count my hair okay <laughs> thank you Catherine. thank you ah, smile don't worry Ana Maria Rivas no maybe she's busy 
Guillermo is still at work, he says. Karen? Um, creo que habemos dos Karen. Ah, oh, well, I mean, let me see. Karen. No, right now. No. Um, no. no, right now, no. I just have no. Fatima, no. Roxana, Monica, Wood, Walter, Sandra, Ana, Consola, David, Catherine, Ana Maria, Guillermo, Karen, Diego, Gabriela, Brenda, Roberto. No, Karen, you are the only Karen here. You okay. are unique. <laughs> Um, how much uh, is the blouse? How much is the? Ah, yeah, I got it. <laughs> how much is the blouse? Yeah. Yes. Next. How many? No, how many? No. Okay. <laughs> Diego or oh, Karen? No, no, Diego. Okay. Uh, always in example with how much or how many, right? Yeah, you can give the two examples. So it will be the, I mean, like, like the recommended. <laughs> okay. And uh, first, uh, maybe how much? It's uh, how much sugar do you like in your coffee? Ah, excellent. Good question. And how much? How many? Excuse me. How many? Uh -huh. mm, mm, let me see. How many pictures do you buy? <laughs> Good. How many pictures? Pictures. Yeah. Buy, yes. yeah. Okay. That's okay. The, those are good questions. I like it. And the, the first one, I like it more, okay? How much sugar do you like in your coffee? Yeah, I like it. Gabriela Vasquez? Teacher. Hi. Second attendant. Uh, no time, I think so, 8.40. Okay. Thank you, Roxana, for remembering me, but it's 8.40, I think so. Roxana, uh, sorry, Gabriela. No, she's busy, maybe. Brenda? Maybe also she's busy. Roberto Guzman? Hello. Hello. Okay. Uh, my sample with many. Uh, huh? What many should how much? Um, how much sugar do you use for a dessert? For a? Okay, and the second one? Hello. Uh huh. And the other one, okay, that is with how much and how many? What about how many? No. Hello, sir. Can you hear me? Yeah. Oh, okay. Es que se me cortó. Don't worry, Mr. Guzman. Okay. The example with for many holes are there in your neighbor. Uh, how much sugar do you use for a dessert? Okay. How much sugar? Yeah. Good. Okay. Right now, you are going to work. I mean, five questions, okay? You want to write down five questions. Uh, you are going to work, uh, you are going to write down five questions. And also right now, uh, I mean, and you are going to do two things. 
Uh, let me see. Let me see. You are going to be sending to the breakout rooms, okay, to complete this part of the manual, okay? Exercise number five. First and after, also, you are going to write down five questions. Okay, no, maybe three questions, okay? You are going to write down three questions uh, about how much and how many to ask to some of your classmates. And also, you have to complete the exercise number five using uh, how much and how many, okay? Uh, also, obviously, the question that you have to write, they don't have to be from the book. They, they have to be from you, from your own, okay? You got it, guys? Hello? Uh, teacher, eh, yo no tengo el, el manual. No sé. I'm going to sí, share no again on the group, okay? Let me see. I'm going to share again on the group. Yeah, because I think so that some of you were. Um, that's it. Okay, it's there again on the group, Karen. Okay, you are going to be sending and maybe... Okay, thank you. You're welcome. And maybe some of you can, I mean, if you can also take a picture from your manual and share in your group, it's, it, we, it will be okay, okay? I mean, let me see. What page number is it? Okay, you're going to be sending to this one. When you get out, you are going, I'm going to pat, I'm going to go for the attendance, okay? Teacher. Hi. ¿Qué número de página es? It's page 10. Okay, thank you. You're welcome. Eh, how much is cuánto, verdad? Yes, both are cuántos. How well, many is cuántos? Both are like that. The point is that one of that is used for countable and the other one is for uncountable. Okay. En la primera dice. What? How much is right? Lo, lo pueden ver. Sí, sí, sí. Vaya. Está bien así lo más grande. Ah, está bien. La número, la número dos. Como son libros también. How many do these books cost? No, pero yo creo que ahí dice cuánto cuesta este libro. Este Use your English, guys. I'm here. Ajá. Uh -huh. <laughs> <laughs> so many. 
How many? Uh -huh. How many? How many? How, how many? Yeah. How many the test book close? The three. The number three. The number three is uh, how much? Because it's the now is better. contestar estas cinco, estas seis y hacer las tres oraciones, me imagino. Mm. Tres sí. extra. Dice Roberto Catena. Es lo que yo he alcanzado a escuchar, es que se me está cortando. Yo no escuché el... nada. Es internet. Es que acaba de mandar un mensaje ahí decía. Ajá. I am here. Remember Perdón. that you have to create three questions. <laughs> like Alexa, remember, you have to create three questions, guys. Don't forget. It. <laughs> smile, uh, smile. Oh, so. No, bro. Excellent. That is a, an apple. Time is all. Hi. Intratex. Mm -hmm. Where is my here is here is my friend is my here is my friends don't say anything really? my... what about Brenda and what about David? It's just David said how many in the first sentence. I think I that's what that's right. Karen Castillo. Karen, are you are you here, Karen? Maybe she's busy. Oh. Um, right now he's here. How much uh, how see. much do this boot a cop? Okay, and the second one, what do you Sorry, Mr. Guzman, what, what would you like to ask me? Oh, yes, teacher. Uh, and then is the response the number five that is six, uh, complete how much or how many, and also that three uh, examples. No, also you have to create three questions. You have to be like how much and how many, like three questions that you will ask to your classmates. Uh, and then you have to write down three questions. And the number five of the exercise, the manual. No, yeah, you have to complete exercise number five, and also you have to create uh, three questions. Okay. Ah, okay. How much? Oh. No, how many? Porque le está hablando ya de, 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 de galones y los galones pueden escuchar. Mm. Oh, ¿qué piensas? Why? That. Ah, sí, en la, en la seis. Six. Mm -hmm. How many? ¿Cuántos galones? ¿Cuántos galones de agua necesitas? Yo le puedo decir que necesito 10 galones. Se podría contar. What? How? Where? 
La pregunta es how many gallons of water. Oh, does it depends. Let here? me see which one, the first one or which one? PCs, number one, how much or how many? How many? Yeah, how because many? there is countable. Yeah. Remember that also you have to create three equations, okay? To ask to your classmates. How many? How many? What? No, I Okay. Teacher, solo el ejercicio 5 era, ¿verdad? And you have to create three questions, yeah? Oh. Ok. How many do you... Remember that you have to create the question, guys. Yes. How many do you spend... When, when do? Columns of water does this need? Well, because we can count a gallon, a bottle. It would be a bottle instead this word. And the, and the fixed question and the thing can. Um, how, how much? How much? I don't, I don't know. How, Number six. I don't know. How now? If, if, if we get rid of the word gallons, we can say how much water does this need. But it's, it's, a, it's saying how many gallons of water. You can have one, two, three gallons of water, you know. You can say, uh, if you say instead that word, you can say bottle. Uh, I think it's how, how many? Because it, it, it's have the plural nouns that is gallons after the question, how many? So, how much money do you have? Number six. How many gallons of water does this need? Yo digo que sería en six. How many? Yeah, I think so. Entonces la en five and six and six sería how many? On three. 
How many? And four. How much? Number. Let me let me tell you. And the number five is we were we were we were discussing about the whole of this sentence, the whole of this sentence. So in the in the number five, we was according it would be how much. Yes. Attendance time right now, yes. Roxana. Let me see. Let me see. Shoo, shoo, shoo. Okay, attendance time. Ana Consuelo Amaya. Present teacher. Ana Maria Rivas. Present teacher. Brenda Angélica Díaz. Present teacher. Karen Beatriz Castillo. Present teacher. David Armando Romero. Present teacher. Diego Rodolfo Ruano. Present. Fátima Laura Mejía. Present teacher. Gabriela Margarita Vázquez. Present teacher. Guillermo Josué Osorio. José Roberto Ramírez. Present. Karen Patricia Ramírez. Catherine Guadalupe. Present. Mónica Liliana Ocotán. Present. Roberto Antonio Guzmán. I'm here. Roxana Elizabeth Ramírez. Present teacher. Ruth Margot Benítez. Present teacher. Sandra Yamilet Alvarado. Present teacher. Walter Manuel Reyes. Present teacher. Okay, very good. We have a full house, yes. What is missing? Okay. Uh, let's gonna start. I think so that you wanna know the answers of the exercises, yeah? No. Okay, no. <laughs> no? Do you want? No. 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 Tell me. Yes or not? Just at one. Just at two. Thumb up or thumb down. If you need the answers, thumbs up. If you don't want to see the answers, thumbs down. Down, up, up. Excellent. Thank you. Okay. Let's gonna see. Let me see. Oh, well, let's gonna let's gonna share the screen. Okay. Thank you. I know that you wanna know the answers. Ah, uh, but before that, just let me tell you. Consuelo, Ana Consuelo Amaya. Yes. You are going to be the first one of today. You are the winner of the lotto, Consuelo. You know what it means? Uh, number one. No. You are the winner of the lotto. You have to stay with me today after the class ends. You have to stay with me the 10 minutes more. Please, Consuelo, if you have any question or something. But even if you don't have, you can stay and you can ask me something. Okay, Consuelo, you got it? No, Consuelo? Yes? No, teacher. Ah, okay. Uh -huh. Let me see. Why? Okay, Consuelo, you got it right now? You could see your chat. Okay, teacher. Thank you. Okay, uh, well, I said that we are going to answer, no? 
Let me see. We're going to answer the exercise. I'm doing, I'm doing. Okay, number first, number one. Sorry, number one, number first. Sorry. Number one. How much or how many? Who says how much? I say how many? How Who many? says how many? How many, many? teachers? Okay, how many? How many? Who says how much? Nobody. How many? Excellent. The first one is how many? No. I think so that they have. So you have. That's it. Number two. How much or how many? How many? How many? How many? Just how much? Ah, <laughs> who says how much and who says how many? I say, I say how much, Robert Bertrand. So why, how, why, Robert? I that is asking about the price of something. Yeah. The, exactly. the book is talking about the cost of the book, not about the book. That's why is how much does it cost? That's why how much do these books cost? That's why is how much, guys? Because it's talking about the cost, not about the books. You got it? Questions? No. Anybody has any question about this? No? Okay. Uh, I don't know. So let me. Mr. Ruano, can you read how it will be the number three? How much? Uh, okay. Uh -huh. And uh, number three. Yeah. Uh, mm, I how much is the battery okay, life? Then. How much is the battery life of this computer? So let me tell you, Mr. Rano, that. So sure. it's okay. <laughs> <laughs> How much is the battery life of this computer? Yeah, how much? <laughs> how much is life? Okay, now I want to see, I want to see who's the winner, who's the winner, the winner, who's the winner. Catherine, number four. Can you read the number four, Catherine? Okay. Uh, how much? Uh huh. How much? Uh, hours do I charge it? Yeah. Do you do you do I charge it? Uh, thank you, Catherine. But it's how many? Because hours you can count the hours. Okay. Because you can count the hours. Okay. Then then that is how many hours? Uh, how many hours do I have? Okay. Everybody is agree or I don't know. Everybody agree or disagree? How many? How many? Yeah, that's it. Walter, can you read the number five, Walter? How many? How? How many? How many money? How many money? Mm, do you have? I I didn't know agree. I think so that is much, says Mr. Bertrán. Yeah, because money How for much? the gringos is uncountable. I don't know why, but for gringos or for people from the U.S. or from the United Kingdom, the money is uncountable. No, it's like not for us, no, because we are like people that we count the money, but they don't count the money. Maybe because that is the, the land of freedom and liberty, the freedom of, I mean, uh -huh, of freedom, the land of freedom, they don't count the money. That's why money, it's an uncountable noun. That's why is how much money. Okay, Mr. Reyes? Okay. Okay, everybody? 
And like a female, Ruth Margot Benitez. Last one. We, we choose mm, how, how many? How many? Gallons where does this need? Oh, my God. Let me tell you that it's okay. <laughs> Let me tell you that it's okay because we are talking about a measure, okay? We are not just talking about the water. We are talking about gallons. That's why that's a measure. In gallons, you can count gallons, not the water, but in this case, you can count the gallons. Not, uh, I mean, maybe if you say how much water does it need, maybe we have to use how much, but as we are talking about a measure, we can say how many gallons. Okay, guys? Yes? Do you have any yes. question? Do you have any question about this? Any um, any um, feedback that you need? Entonces sería how much? No. How many? Yeah. How many? Yeah. I'm stop sharing. Who says uh, it's how it's how many because you are talking about the gallons. Let me tell you. If you were saying maybe how much what how much water maybe you have to use how much but if you are if you are if you are talking sorry if are you are talking about how many gallons of water uh, i mean that is like this if you say how much uh how much sugar but if you say how many uh, uh, spoons of sugar that is different because when you use spoons, you are using a measure. You are using a countable thing. That's why you use how many spoons of <clears throat> sugar. But if you are using how much without spoons, you have to use how much sugar. You got it? Or do I have to explain again? Tell me. Okay. Okay. Are you, you got it, Sandra? Yes? Yes. Robert. Okay, Roberto, you got it. You are good. Walter, okay, you got it? Yes. I mean, everybody has understood? Or do I have to explain? Or do I show you another? Or do I give you another example? I don't know. Yes. Maybe my English is not good, but I'm trying to. And also, I mean, I'm trying to speak just in English because you have to be forced. I don't know if you are not speaking because I think you think that, I mean, I cannot speak because they teach or something like that. Uh, you have like a three minutes in Espanol. Esta es la primera vez. No sé si tienen alguna duda. Este, sí, ah, Espanol, ya lo aclaré. Voy a tratar de hablar inglés. Me estoy pasando los tres minutos porque es la primera clase. Aclaro, por ejemplo, Ana Consuelo, que es la que se tiene que quedar en los diez minutos. Igual a cada uno le iré diciendo al final de, de a, acerca de cuando esté terminando la clase. ¿Por qué no lo digo antes? Porque algunos se corren. <ríe> Dicen, mire, me toca a mí, pues no, no voy a ir. <ríe> Pero ustedes no son así, son otros grupos, ¿ok? Les comento lo que ha pasado con otros grupos. Ustedes no son así, ¿ok? That's why. Uh, por eso, a lo, no sé, any doubt, alguna duda, créanlo o no. Eh, va a ser de las últimas veces que me van a oír hablar español, de ahí pues de mi, de mi parte olvídense del español y yo pues, y ustedes traten de acordarse más del inglés no sé, any doubt alguna duda, o si me dicen si tengo que bajar más slow mi nivel de inglés you are good <laughs> thank you Mr. Bertrand you are good, I like that <laughs> yeah, thank you Mr. Bertrand what about the others, ¿Qué piensan nosotros Everything fine. Bien, baje un poquito. Ah, baje, Catherine dice, okay, I'm going to try, Catherine, okay? I'm going to try, Catherine. I'm, I'm pumped. Yeah. Okay, thank you, Mr. Ruano. Uh -huh. What about the others? I want to try, but even uh, uh, as, I, as I was telling you, eh, o como les estaba diciendo, algunas cosas, pues, quizás a lo mucho voy a usar el español solo en el chat para comentárselas. Pero aquí clase, casi la clase vamos a hacerla casi eh, purely in English, ¿ok? 
Um, I mean, two minutes are missing. I don't know if you have any comment or any doubt about about the topic. Any, I don't know. I mean, yeah, I don't know. any idea that you have about the topic or I don't know. If you want to share, maybe you can share by the chat just one question, okay? The question that you wrote, las preguntas que escribió, puede escribir una en el chat. Vamos a tratar de leerlas. We have just one minute, but we're going to try to, to read it. Okay. In one minute. And after I will sing to you, you know, you have a singer here because I'm going to sing to you because when the, uh, when, uh, because the class is going to finish. When the class is going to finish, I'm going to sing to you. Okay. Maybe somebody have somebody have told you about me. So you know, um, like a like a song. What about Mr. Beltran? I haven't listened about you, Mr. You haven't. I have listened about you. Really, you have. What you have listened about me? What? What you have listened about me? I I have not listened. Ah, you have about haven't. you. I haven't. Now you are gonna you are gonna know who is Mr. Naharro, okay? Yeah, I like your style. <laughs> You I, are so I, funny. You are the the whole time. Are you making jokes? That's good. <laughs> I like that. I haven't I haven't started, Mr. Beltran. I haven't started. Wow, I, have, wow. I, I, I have a, a box of surprises. <laughs> <laughs> That's good. I like that. Okay, thank you. Okay, guys. I think so. That just means Amaya Merino can go. She can go. She has to stay. But the other one, I mean, you can, one, two, three. You can close your eyes and go to your beds to dance. Do you feel your pillow under your head? Do you feel the same? <laughs> okay, the class half finished, guys. You can close your eyes and go to your bed because I know that you want to go, okay? Just... Consuelo Maya cannot go today, but tomorrow she can go. Okay. Very good, teacher. <laughs> Thank, tomorrow, you. teacher. <laughs> Thank you. Bye. Good night, teacher. Good night. Have good a good night. night. Guys. See you good tomorrow night, at the teacher. same time. Do the homework, guys. Do the homework, please. Uh, oh. Please. Bye. Just Consuelo have to stay here. <laughs> <laughs> Bye. Has to stay here, yeah. See you tomorrow, teacher. Sorry, Consuelo. See you tomorrow. Bye bye. Bye bye. Night. Good night. Bye. See you tomorrow. Good night, teacher. Nice Good to night, meet you. Sir. Thank you. Yeah. Bye, teacher. Good night. Bye, mister. Okay, Consuelo, how can I help you? Do you have any question, Consuelo? <laughs> uh, I cannot listen to you. You have to op open your mic. Right now. Hi, yeah. teacher. <laughs> Good night. Uh, how much money do you need for the week you have to pour? Don't ask me that, please. <laughs> I mean, I'm a poor man. I, you know, I have three works. This is my third work. Yeah. And I don't have money for the week. <laughs> no. <laughs> no. Don't worry. I mean, I don't know. I mean, like, uh, I don't know. I have, I don't have a, I don't have established budget. I don't have. Maybe it could be like, um, $25 maybe or $50 per week. Just, I mean, just for my for my expense, okay? Uh, so uh, no, the, 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 the spend of the houses of my daughters because I have two daughters of my wife because I have a wife. I mean, just my expense, maybe uh, maybe $25, 20, 25 boxes per, per week, maybe. What about you, Consuelo? How much money do you have? <laughs> uh, 
$10. Oh my God, per week. For week. Oh, but you, but, but I mean, but with $10 and also you have to spend for your food with $10? You listen to me. You have to spend for your food. Um, no, uh, just for just for the traveler by bus, the bus, and that's it. Yes. What about the food? How do you have your food? Um, the the house. Ah, good. The house. I envy you. La envidio. Because I have to eat out. Then we come in afuera. That's why. And to eat out and <laughs> to eat out, it's very, it's it's very expensive to eat out. Yes. Um, uh -huh. any other question, Consuelo? Solo una is a teacher. That's why. No, don't worry. But right now you can do another question that you have about the class or about me. I mean, don't worry. I mean, that's okay that you have done the question. But right now you can ask me something about the class or about something. Puede preguntarme algo de la clase o, o, sea, um, o, o sobre el tema. I mean, I don't know. Um, este, estaba confundido con eso del how, how many, how much. Eh, Todavía. Sí, okay. yes. How much is for the nouns that they are uncountable? Para los nombres que no podemos contar. Lo voy a hacer con los ejemplos aquí. Por ejemplo, sí. el agua no la podemos contar. Por eso aquí sería how much. Ah, how pero, much. Porque, ajá, pero ¿por qué ya no pongo how much aquí? Permítame. I'm going to take notes. Va. Uno dice que al ver agua sería how much. Pero cuando veo galones, ah, los galones sí se cuentan. Entonces los galones son how many. Vamos a ver la primera. La primera son piezas. ¿Puedo contar las piezas sí o no? Sí. Entonces, ¿cuál sería, Consuelo? Sería how many. Exacto. How many. ¿Por qué? Porque puedo contar las piezas. En la dos. En la dos hay una tricky. Porque no está hablando de los libros, sino que está hablando de la pregunta ¿cuánto cuestan? Mm. Como, está, como yo nunca sé cuánto cuestan las cosas, cuando estoy preguntando cuánto cuestan, entonces, ¿cuál sería la pregunta? Entonces sería how much. Exacto, porque como yo no sé cuánto cuesta eso, how much do these books cost? Ah, va. How much is the battery life? ¿De qué está hablando aquí? De la vida de la batería. Batería de la Ajá, la de vida la, de la, la batería. Entonces, como está hablando de la vida de la batería. ¿ah? ¿Cuál no sería? se puede quitar. How ¿Mm? much? ¿Ah? How much? How much? Ajá, ¿por qué? Porque está hablando de la vida. How much? Exacto, porque está hablando de algo incontable. How much? ¿Ah? La siguiente, la cuatro. Hours, ¿puede contar usted las horas? Yes. Ah, entonces es. How many? How? How many? Exacto. How many, ok. How many hours do I do I charge it? En el money, para los norteamericanos, el money es incontable. It's uncountable. Entonces, ¿cuál sería? How much or how many? How much? Exacto. How much? That's it. You got it right now, Consuelo? Yes, teacher. Is a little bit more clear? Yes. Ah, okay. 
So, any other question that you have, Consuelo? Um, no, teacher. Okay. But also you have like uh, two minutes. You have still two minutes. You can study this board, Consuelo. That is how much, look at. I mean, in this case, is referring to weights, cost, warranty, and storage. That's why they use how much. In this case, it's feature, colors, function, and products. They are things that you can count. That's why you use how many, okay? Yes. Mm -hmm. What about, do you have any comment about the teacher? You don't like the teacher? <laughs> <laughs> Mucho molesta, dicen. No. <laughs> Do you have any comment about the class, Consuelo? Um, Tell me. A, que si tengo otra pregunta, o, o como. About the class. Do you have any comment? Algún comentario. Um, excellent. No, excelente todo. Oh, thank you. Sí, lo único que como a mí me cuesta mucho eh, entender el, el inglés. No se preocupe, Consuelo. En todo caso, muchas veces tal vez lo que voy a hacer es tratar de decirle algo tra a través del chat, digamos así como que, bueno, como le expliqué al final que se tenía que quedar, ¿verdad? Y, pero, este, pero en la medida en lo que oiga, yo sé que va a poder y al final, you are going to speak English, Consuelo, ¿ok? <risa> yes, teacher. <risa> Okay. Esa es la meta. That's the goal. Okay. Yes. Now you can close your eyes and go to your bed. Well, you can go to hammock. <laughs> to your hammock. <laughs> hey, Consuelo. Bye. You can go right Bye, now. If you want. Well, if you want, if you want to stay, you can stay. No. Se quiere ir ya o se quiere quedar. <laughs> Uh, <laughs> go. Ahorita go. Ya okay. tengo que dormir. <laughs> nah, don't worry. That's why I know. Bye, teacher. Bye. Thank you. You're welcome. You're welcome.